Where's Clementine? She's normally here around 8, but it's only like... Hold on. Yeah, it's only like 7. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought she would be late. Hmm, that is not accurate for Clementine. Tch. You're the one to talk. Oh, shut up. Oh, hey Clem. Hey Vals. Um, so, did you hear about the dance? Uh, like, yeah. I am super duper excited for the dance. I was hoping you guys would come with me. What type of country? What type of, what type of question is that? Of course we're going. You're going, but I never agreed to this. And plus, you know me, I am not a dancer. Just because it's called the dance doesn't mean you don't have to still go with us. We can go to the dance and you can still hang out. We don't have to dance or anything, have punch or something like that. But you don't have to dance and you know it. Yeah, but it's about what I'm going to wear. I don't want to embarrass myself. And you know I only have, like, hipster clothes. Like, you know me, I wear pants underneath shorts. Do you think that's perfect for the dance? No, but who said you couldn't come shopping with us? I'll take you to the mall tonight, and we can go shopping. If it's okay with my mom. <sighs> okay, but here's one thing. I can't go. And it's because my mom only lets me stay up until it's like 10. Ugh, so unfair. And I'm 19. I should stay up until midnight. Ugh, same here. My mom only lets me stay up like at like 11.59 until it hits 12. But I'm not allowed until it hits 12. Okay then. We can go after school. How about that? Uh, homework? I know. But we can find a way around that, right? We can do it fast with a calculator since we only have math today. Excuse me? My mom will know if I used a calculator. She knows. She's that kind of person that knocks on your door and then just opens it without the child giving context that they can come in. Oh. Yeah, so I'm not using a calculator. So I'm sorry, but I cannot go. Well. You're gonna miss out. Or I can just go shopping, buy your dresses, and then give them to you tomorrow. Why not on Wednesday? Because today's Monday. Oh, yeah. Well, sorry to burst all of your bubbles, but I have to go. My class starts in five minutes. And I have science with Mrs. Burke, so if she finds out I'm trying to skip, she is going to flip out. She's that kind of teacher that puts you in detention, like, if you're late. Same thing with my math teacher. He is super mean. All the teachers here are mean. Well, anyways, I gotta go. But see you after class? Yeah. Okay, bye. Bye. But anyways, like I said, I can't go to the dance. I told you I would buy the dresses for you, okay? Okay. I'm buying you multiple so that way you can choose from each, okay? Thanks. Okay, now I have the same excuse as Sarah. I gotta go. Okay, I think we have the same class. Okay, yeah, so let's go. Clementine, wait! Hmm? Hmm. Babe, look at me. Sorry, babe. Remember, baby, you always have my heart, and all of those other girls, they'll always break your heart. That's why you have my heart, so I can spare it for you. Oh, um, uh, is that a compliment? Just take it as a love statement, okay, baby? Okay, now kiss me. Mwah. Okay, I gotta go. Um, my friends are, like... Totally stressing over there. And we want to, like, have our girl talks, you know? Uh, yeah. Um, so, what are we... Okay, one last kiss. Mwah. Alrighty. Me and the girls are gonna go. Uh, bye, baby. Mm, bye. See you in class. Mwah, mwah, mwah.
my little chocolate cake. Bye, babe. Girls, let's go. We need to have a talk. Coming. Yes, queen. Over here. I wonder what this talk could be about. Yeah, it's probably not good at all. Uh, coming. I'm coming. Jeez. Okay, so what's the talk about? You'll know if you let me speak. Okay. It's about, you know, the va- Oh my gosh, we can't even say those words. I know what- <sighs> But what about them? <sighs> I'm gonna say it and nobody can stop me. The Valentines have been stealing our reputation. They've even stolen our spot. Like- this right here used to be our spot, and now we only get it once they leave. OMG, like, you're totally right. But I th Don't even talk. I'm not finished yet. So, as I was saying, I really don't like those girls. I really need to get rid of them somehow. But why is it why you don't like them? Are you stupid? I said they're stealing our reputation. Huh? <sighs> But I'll let it slide for a few longer. But after that, things are gonna get a little bit out of hand. But anyways, we need to get going. Oh yeah. And plus, I'm a straight A student. I never get Fs, but let's go. Okay. Yeah, except for that one time you got an F on your... Don't even bring it up, Sarah. Okay. Yeah, so I'm all like, oh, hey, man. Dudes, you will not believe it. Like, what? You just interrupted me. I was having, like, a really good conversation with Jacob right now. Yeah, I know, but that can wait. I just heard my bo my girlfriend plotting against another girl. Uh, why don't you just break up with her? Uh, because then all of us will lose our popularity. And that will also humiliate me and make me look like a fool. Oh yeah, your girlfriend is one of those girls that can't keep secrets. Yeah, she'll totally tell the whole entire school. I know, but we need to get to class. Yeah, who do you have it with? Uh, I have Mrs. B I have Mrs. Burke. <sighs> Lucky, I have math. I have, I have science. Oh my gosh, isn't that the your your girlfriend's and the other girl's class? Yeah, but I need to go. Let's go. Okay, bye, dude. Bye. Okay, class dismissed. Hurry, girls, hurry. We need to get her spot. Yeah. Wait for me. I want to get her spot back. Uh-huh, yeah. Uh-huh. Okay, so girls, I was really planning on, uh, excuse me. <gasps> no. Girls, why did you stop? Oh. Yeah, um, um, can we help you? Haven't you learned to not stare at the one and only Charlotte Rowan? It's not Roland. Oh, it's Roland. But why are you girls staring at us? You know the rules. You're not allowed to stare at me. Uh, sorry to break it to you, Charlotte, but that's our spot. Yeah, what Valentine said. Uh, is that like my new nickname now? Yeah, Clem. <sighs> Whatever. But... As the Valentines, I demand you to get out of our spot. Ah, well, excuse me. As the Queen of Hearts, I demand you to get away from us. Uh, I thought the Valentines were stronger than the Queen of Hearts. Well, excuse me. The Queen of Hearts is in a card game. Well, I think that I rule this spot. We were here first, and so we own it. Says who? Says the school policies. Uh, 
Nobody owns this spot, but I know, since I'm the principal's daughter, I do own that spot. Says who? Says my father. Alrighty, this conversation is getting really boring, so it's rather you leave or I tell your dad that you're bullying us. You? You're bullying me? Uh, says the one who started the fight. You're the one who started it. Uh, am I, girls? Uh, uh, we're sorry, but you are the one who started it. <laughs> You're joking, right? You're not, like, going it off against me, right? We're still friends and we'll never go against you, but you are the one who started this whole entire fight. <laughs> I'll let you off on this one, and I'll agree that I am the one who started the fight. But only under one condition. I'll believe it, and I'll give you what you want for 24 hours tomorrow. And... I will do whatever you say, but you have to let us keep our spot forever until we leave the school. <laughs> Deal. The challenge starts tomorrow. <laughs> Whoa, are you really going to do this? Well, of course I am. Uh, by the way, scram. I said scram. Uh, finally, we have our spot back. You know, instead of Charlotte being the mean girl, you are actually the mean girl back there. Wait, what? Well, you know. I don't remember me being mean. Uh, you should. You just got into a whole argument with the popular girl. Hat, a.k.a. The Queen of Hearts. Uh-oh. Well, how can you already forget? Remember, she has split sides. Oh, yeah. As the leader of the Valentines, I demand that we do not ever cross with the Queen of Broken Hearts. And by the way, in your split side, you... You came a, You... 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 I'll say it if you can't. Yeah, that's probably the best idea. Well, what happened? When you came face to far face to face with the bro with the Queen of Hearts, you gave her a deal. She said that if you said if we kept this spot, you would do whatever she says tomorrow and you'll give her whatever she wants tomorrow for twenty four hours. I said that? How did I agree to such a thing? Well, you didn't agree. You're the one who made it. I did? Yeah, that's how much your split side can do to you. Whoa. Like, whoa indeed. So we need to start plotting something. What if we skip school tomorrow? Why would we do that? You know that will get us in trouble. Yeah, but... I have an idea. What type of idea? An idea that will make the Queen of Hearts regret messing with us.